Ever seen a concrete mixer truck and notice those two extra wheels sitting up top? What are those for? Are they just there for decoration? Those extra wheels actually play a critical role in how these trucks operate. Stick around and we'll break it down in a way that's easy to understand. Those extra wheels are officially known as tag axles or lift axles. They're designed to be raised or lowered depending on the truck's load. You'll usually see them lifted when the truck is empty, but once it's loaded with heavy concrete, they come down to help distribute the weight. Now, depending on who you ask and where you are, these wheels have picked up a few other nicknames over the years. Some people call them drop axles, pusher axles, booster axles, or just plain helper wheels. Each name kind of points to the same idea, extra support when the truck is loaded heavy. No matter what you call them, their job stays the same. Carry the load and protect the road. Concrete is extremely heavy. A full truck can weigh over 60,000 pounds. Roads and bridges have strict weight limits to prevent damage, and that's where these extra wheels come in. By lowering them, the truck spreads its weight across more axles making it road legal and preventing excessive wear on the pavement. Without tag axles, mixer trucks could easily exceed weight limits, leading to expensive fines and serious road damage. Plus, concentrating too much weight on just a few axles can cause faster tire wear, stress the truck's suspension, and even make the truck harder to control safely. Next time you see a concrete mixer truck with those extra wheels, you'll know they're not just for looks. They're a smart, critical system for balancing weight, protecting roads, and keeping everything moving safely. Pretty cool, right? If you found this interesting, make sure to like, subscribe, and stick around for more cool facts about the concrete world. See you in the next one.